feedback of Deutsche Bank clients, not just in Germany, but around Europe? Well, there's a very positive response to um, the re-election of uh, Chancellor Merkel. Um, however, we see that um, uh, obviously uh, she did not achieve an absolute majority. She was very clear and uh, very, very uh, near to that. But uh, obviously we will go for another coalition um, government and that will be the very exciting question for the um, next couple of weeks, how these talks and how uh, this will devolve in, in, in uh, the meantime. So there's still an element of uncertainty, but um, financial markets and investors don't seem to be that concerned. No, I don't think that there is really an, an element of uncertainty. Um, it is clear that uh, we will not get new elections or see a minority government as uh, some outside observers already speculated. Uh, it is a normal process in Germany uh, that we have coalition governments and um, uh, when we look at uh, the agenda of the two um, major parties, the um, Conservative Party of Angela Merkel and the Social Democrats, there are some sticking points but um, I am convinced that uh, we will arrive at an uh, good um, uh, coalition agreement in due time. So overall, um, regarding the Eurozone crisis, um, Germany's policies will continue to be the same. You don't anticipate any change in that. Um, I think that uh, the, the election results clearly show that uh, the broad public endorsed Merkel's um, approach towards um, the Eurozone stabilization, which is um, providing uh, fiscal solidarity in return for um, commitment for reforms and changes in uh, the troubled countries. Um, I wouldn't say that we see any change. Uh, I think we will see some softer stance vis-à-vis um, -vis, um, uh, the question of uh, how to get um, growth uh, running in, 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 in Europe, uh, maybe some more focus on investment, not only in Germany but uh, in, in Europe as well, um, uh, some more debate on how to fund that. But uh, again, as you said, the overall stance will be more or less alike. But you do expect um, further financing for the countries, for the bailout countries, um, most notably Greece. You expect further financing, but still no haircuts. Um, well, what we have on the agenda for the rest of this year and next year is clearly make sure that the troubled countries like Greece uh, Portugal and Ireland um, uh, continue to um, uh, get uh, uh, fiscal support um, for Portugal and Ireland. Um, there will be some uh, facilitating um, for the countries to make sure that they can return to the capital markets and uh, the German government already before the election um, uh, uh, supported um, uh, uh, to, to help Greece um, uh, in further down the road, um, not in terms of a haircut, but uh, as uh, Finance Minister Schäuble said, there will be some um, a solution to the financial needs of Greece.